Lalalalalao. 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 Hi everybody, this is she, Miss Nawundu, and you are tuned into Miss Nawundu. That is the name of my channel. And today I'm actually here to talk about what I call toxic dynamics. First of all, dynamics and then toxic dynamics. You will find that in your life, there are dynamics where you fit in and your role in those dynamics is set. You'll find that in your family, there's, there's a role for you. In, in, in your friendship circle, there's a role for you. Um, in, 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 in society, there's a role that's been assigned for you. And all these roles have been assigned to you. And what happens is that when you get yourself out or work yourself out of those roles, and you work yourself out of the script, that comes with those roles and the movements and the, you know, the reactions and actions that come with those roles. The people in the play are not going to like you. The cast is not going to like you. The family is not going to like you. The friendship circle is not going to like you. The work um, colleagues are not going to like you. The moment you step outside of the role that you've been assigned in any toxic environment, in any toxic environment, in any toxic dynamic. And what I came here today to tell you is don't let anyone boss you around and corner you into staying in a role that no longer fits you and that you no longer fit into. I'm going to say that again. Don't let anyone corner you into staying in, in, into remaining in a role that you no longer fit into, that you no longer that no longer fits you, that you can no longer say the lines for and, and do the actions for. Um, because what I found about particularly toxic uh, dynamics is that they, they, they are there to hinder you. They are there to arrest your development. And they are there particularly, let's say in a family um, dynamic or in a family context, they are there to keep you in a position where you're a child and you're now an adult and you're independent and you want to you're able to make decisions on your own and think for yourself and move according to your own convictions. But the toxic dynamic says, your role is this, and this is how you will be, and this is what you must think, and this is the role you must play. And the moment you don't play according to that role, yes, there will be contention. Yes, people won't like that. And it's the same with friendships. Um, I have been in situations, and I'm sure you have been in situations where there were there was a dynamic, and then it developed somewhere in the dynamic of the friendship. They they came a toxic that they, they developed a toxic dynamic where your role was to overlook um, immoral behavior. Your role was to overlook. Um, wrong behavior and wrong attitudes and when you step out of that and you decide i'm no longer going to overlook uh immorality i'm no longer going to overlook something that is wrong i'm not going to overlook sin i'm not going to overlook something that is no longer a part of my conviction because i have changed you lose your friends but i'm here to say don't let anyone corner you into a role that you no longer fit into or boss you around to go back and fit into a role that you no longer fit into. Sometimes it's not necessarily even a, a toxic dynamic, but it's a dynamic that you no longer fit into in a particular role. And you find that the moment you step outside of that role so that you can grow and that you do not remain in arrested development, people don't like that because everyone is comfortable in their roles. But the thing is about coming out of arrested development is that you are coming out of a small box and you are expanding your territory 
and you are expanding your growth and you are deepening and widening your your reach and your and your growth and your development and anything that wants to stunt that is not something that's good anything that wants to stunt that is not something that should be listened to or be submitted to so I don't know what your situation is and what role that it is that you need to get out of, whether it's in your family dynamic, in your friendship dynamic, in your work dynamic, or just the dynamic within yourself, the relationship with yourself. There's a role that you fit into that, oh, you the RT one who's never going to succeed and always has money problems. That could be going on in your own mind. And then everybody else takes the cue from you do you need to get out of that role and demand more from yourself and require more from yourself and take responsibility for yourself so that you're no longer the one who's expected to always be available, whose time is always an, an, an asset and, and something that can be taken from them and used because, well, she doesn't have a job, he doesn't have a job, he has nothing to do, she has nothing to do. So, we can always take their time. We can always depend on them to always be available. Is that dynamic happening within yourself? And you keep looking outside of yourself and blaming everyone for putting you into a certain role. But it's up to you. It's up to you to get yourself out of a role that you no longer fit into. So before you go blaming other people, start with yourself. Because you cooperate with every role that you are playing in any dynamic, toxic dynamic, positive dynamic, you, you are cooperating with that role. Think about the roles that you are cooperating with. Have you outgrown those roles or are you really that role? Um, does that role fit you or does it no longer fit you anymore? And when it doesn't fit you, that's the, what, what I'm here to tell you today is that when the role doesn't fit you anymore, when you're no longer willing to uh, sing the lines and, and be involved in the song and dance of a toxic role, do not let anyone boss you around into staying into that, in that role. Do not let anything scare you or intimidate you and try to corner you into going back into a role that you no longer fit into, a role that you are no longer willing to say the lines to and do the song and dance to. Yes, what's going to happen is that people are not going to like you for growing. People are not going to like you for developing and breaking free from arrested development. Some people might even be hurt because the moment roles change, or at the moment someone changes their role in a dynamic, people get hurt somehow. It hurts because it means that as you change your own role, other people's roles are affected and it creates this domino effect where there's this if effect um, of change going all across the board. And if, 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 if it's for a good reason that you are changing your role, then the, the, the domino effect is a good reason. It's shaking people up. But people don't like it because it demands more of them. It demands that, oh, they make adjustments as well and wake up and stop just saying the lines and doing the song and dance and fitting in the way they have been assigned. Um, but I just... I just want to encourage you just, you know, in those roles and in those dynamics, take courage and stick to your guns. Take courage and stick to your guns and stick to your conviction. Because when you step out of a role that has been assigned you, that, or that you have been assigned, when you step out of a role that you have been assigned, um, because you need to grow, you need to develop, you need to widen and broaden. When you step out of a role that you've been assigned, um, a lot of people are not going to like it. Stand. Stick to your guns and fight for your development and fight for your freedom. And stand and it might be lonely and it will be lonely. You will lose friends. Family members will be mad at you 
people will will sulk because they don't understand because you're messing up with you know with the you you messing with the ecosystem but there's no harmony in an ecosystem if something in the ecosystem is suffering then that's not a harmonious ecosystem that's not a harmonious dynamic and you're always trying to go for a trying to go for a, a harmonious dynamic where things are in harmony and things work when people are trying to hold you back from growing from widening from deepening that's no longer a harmonious um, dynamic because someone is trying to keep you from growing and they're saying I like you when you are in arrested development just freeze here as far as you've gone just freeze here and stay with me in my frozen space and in my frozen place don't grow I'm here to say don't allow anyone to boss you or corner you into staying in a role particularly in a toxic dynamic that you no longer want to partake partake in or be a part of or play in don't let anyone try to keep you there stick to your guns stand in your conviction stand alone if you have to always very good to share with you the things that God is teaching me and showing me uh, stay well and be well I invite you to look into this playlist over here <laughs> where you will find a lot of videos that I've uploaded and also peruse through the channel and look throughout all the playlists that are available and if you like what you see subscribe over here on this icon that is my face just click onto there and you will be a subby and you will get first notification of every time that I upload a new video see you next time love 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 bye like to dance alone to the beat of the rebel revolution cause when the heat is on and the wind is still it's all on your will chill and be chill